what up guys it's your man with the plan Pori! what's up so um yeah i know um in my last video my hair was really messy so i went ahead and straightened it this is the same day that i recorded my last video so yeah guys um like i told you guys earlier in my last video that i was going to do another taste like peace tea episode um i don't know how many peace teas there really is that are like available to purchase in the United States but I think there's one that I know for sure that I haven't tried on here um, but yeah guys if you guys do know how many peace teas there are in the world leave it down in the description um, if you guys don't know what this series contains I will tell you tastes like peace tea is a series uh, where that I made um, where I go and I taste different peace teas. I'll go to the gas station or the stores and buy them. I have two other series that you guys can go check out. It's kind of like that. Um, called Taste Like Monster and Taste Like um, Taste Like Brisk. I will be trying to do those sometime soon too. Um, I don't know how long it's going to be until I do a Taste Like Monster episode. Because Monster is way more expensive than Brisk. And piece tea put together um i mean it's not expensive but it's it's just over pricey for what it should be like i don't know anyways let's get right on to the video guys now um now today we're gonna go back to the really colorful piece tea cans um the last one i drank was the green tea win one which I didn't really care for you guys can go watch that video um, but this one I haven't really tried but I've took sips off of it before like my sister had uh, one and I was sipping off of hers but it is uh, raspberry um, and it's got that cool logo where it has the the peace sign and then the little fruit in its hand which I thought was really cool I like these cans better they're just so much colorful um so yeah but um um I still don't understand how these are made with like zero percent of like juice like you would think that there's at least like a couple percent of juice in there what if they're lying to us and there really is juice in there but they don't want us to think that there's juice in there <laughs> blew your mind uh, but no really guys um I just got this out of the fridge I bought it Last night, when I went to the store, I bought these and a couple other things. Um, I thought about doing a haul about the stuff that I bought last night at Walmart. Um, but yeah, guys, let's just get on to the video. And yeah, so here's the can. It's kind of shiny. Um, yeah, but um, let's open it right up. It says, natural flavors, no colors added, and made with peace, love, and happiness. See, that's kind of why I like these is because, like, they have the perfect slogans on them. Made with peace, love, happiness. I don't know what the fuck that was. If you guys could hear that, then. <laughs> but it sounded like some, like, fireworks went off or something. But that's understandable. Fireworks are tonight. At the Miller. Um, back to the video. I'm getting off topic in this video a lot. And this video is already three minutes and I haven't tried the thing yet. But let's get right into it, okay? Um, but yeah, like I said, the peace sign and stuff, um, I think this was like the first one I tried for this series, which is really good. I have drunk like two of them this whole entire, in my whole entire life, I think, but, uh, we're going to try raspberry and I'm going to tell you guys what I think about it. So let's open it up. It tastes really, really good. Like, probably one of the best ones I've tasted. It's just so good. It has a lot of flavor to it. I would give it... I'd give it a 10. Um, I would. I'd give it a 10. It's really, really good. And, um... Yeah. But yeah, guys, um, I don't know how many more of these are in the series, but I'd give it a 10. I suggest you guys go try this one, because this one's one of my favorites out of the whole one, out of all of them I've tried. And this is like 
the fourth one that I've actually tried on here. This is actually probably the fourth one I've ever tried too. Because I haven't tried most of them because I try to like not try them um, and like save them for the series. Um, but yeah guys, uh, that's my reaction um, for this is that you guys should totally go buy it. It's dope. Uh, It's just so good. I feel like if I had a couple of these, I would be able to just stay in my house for days on end. If and and food, but mainly like drink wise, like these, like just this flavor. Like I don't even care about the other ones right now. This one's my favorite one out of all of them so far. Um, I thought about trying Snowberry next, um, if I can find it, because I know there's a Snowberry one. I don't know how many are out there, but after I end this video, I will go ahead and look it up and see how many are in the series, and or how many piece teas there are, um, and stuff like that. But the gas station I went only sold like three different ones. They didn't sell all of them. They only had like three different slots in their refrigerator for piece tea, which, I, you know, sometimes it's hard to find certain things like this. Like, but yeah, guys, um, I'm gonna move on and go, and. Uh, in the video here <laughs> ooh that means it's good <laughs> but no guys excuse me by the way but yeah guys um I'm gonna end this video here if you liked it hit the like button share it with your friends family and associates don't forget to be PR test don't forget to join the PR nation and don't forget to be a reckless Riley I will see you guys in the next video um leave down in the in the comments which piece tea is your guys' favorite do you guys like piece tea and which ones do you want me to try next? Um, and yeah, guys. But I'll see you guys in the next video. <gasps> Bye. Deuces. Later. Homie. Oh, by the way. I will leave a link at the very top for the playlist of Taste Like Peace Tea. So you guys can go and check out some of the older ones if you guys want to. Um, but I will talk to you guys in the next video. <gasps> Bye. Ow, I ran my toe over. Ow. But no, really, guys. I'll see you guys later.